Larry Brady. Kind of want to send him out there and see what he does. Let's do it. I'm not cleaning them off. Let's do it. Go, Brady. Go. Go. <laughs> Wait. Come on. <laughs> he immediately turned back around. <laughs> That's fun, huh? Yep. What's in there? Bowls. So I'm going to put all of the juice that I'm going to make, or all of the fruit. We didn't show what we're doing. So, so we have carrots. Vegetable. Wheat. Fruit. Apples. Grapes. Beets. Can't really tell. Wait. Whatever. Yeah, beets. Not the headphones. And then, uh, right. And what then is that? Ginger. Yep. Mint. Pina. And, uh. Greens. Yeah, greens. Some baby kale. Baby spinach. I don't know why they're both babies, but yeah. Babies. And we have all this because... We are going to be juicing. Yeah, we bought a oh. juicer. Yeah, we bought a juicer. Yeah, I guess I should kind of show it a little bit. It's a little dark, a little dim. Yep. All right, literally we started juicing because we tried out. So we got this thing full of juice. It was about $50 for us just for like a promo thing. And then... Uh, Normally it's $50 per person for three days and you get... Six. I mean, it's a decent deal if you think about everything you get. You don't have to buy the juicer. You don't have to juice it yourself. Like the time and the effort, and you get snacks. We were like, man, if we want to do this regularly, we might as well just do it ourselves. So we bought a juicer, and I'm already realizing it's a lot more work than I'm fine with the work. I remembered. So my idea. Let's see if I can get this turned around. So my idea is to actually get this to where it it's cost effective. Like under a hundred dollars for three days. So this thing oh. cost this thing cost a hundred dollars for for three days, right? I bought the juicer. I mean, that's all sunk cost anyways. And we were gonna pay that either way um, with this. And the, the idea is to get in micronutrients without having to, to eat all of this. Normally, right. I'm not one like I'm not normally big on liquid calories, but with the lack of time and just drive for eating fruits and vegetables lately, I figured we might as well just juice for a little bit. Well, I'm not going to eat all of that. That's a lot of chewing. <laughs> Makes me sound lazy, but I mean, that's... Who, it's just who juice, does that? Juice and smoothies are a great way to pack in a lot of micronutrients for not a whole lot of volume. So if you struggle with getting a lot of volume or you can't eat enough, you know, greens, like nobody wants to sit there and eat a salad. Most people don't. So either yeah. adding it to... Smoothies. Uh, smoothies are ideal because you actually keep all the fiber, but juicing is also a good way too. Yeah, but somehow we're going to fit this guy all the way over here. There's already so much room that we're working with that it shouldn't be a problem, right? Make so, we'll figure it out. The Wyatt's 25 foot trailer, about to get more packed. <laughs> okay, I think, so I think what's going to happen, because this thing, oddly enough, didn't come with like usually juicers will come with like a large measuring cup that'll tell you how many ounces, but I didn't realize it doesn't come with one. So what we're gonna have to do is juice into some kind of cup. And as we juice, we're just gonna pour it into this bowl to mix. So this juice is going to have, we've got carrot, grape, apple, lemon, uh, and ginger. Yeah, how do you do this? Boom! Oh, it works. So you just put them in and is there, there's just one speed, huh? We're gonna break this immediately. Let's do it. Try it, try it. Try, try a little bit of the carrot, just the carrot juice by itself. It's pretty good. Huh. Tastes like carrot. Look at that color though. Oh, that's beautiful. A tenth of the way down. Let's go. Time lapse mode, go! All right, and here's our uh, Wyatt punch. So we've got our little jars lined up. And uh, we don't know if we got proportions right, right? Here. Yeah, have you tried it? Not yet. Okay, let me try it. It's delicious. Yeah? Yes. Ooh, that ginger punches you afterwards. Yeah, I know it does. That's and then the turmeric will get you too. I mean, well, just as far as the initial That's putting good. it in. Awesome. All right, I'm gonna start getting it out of there. We also realized that we need a funnel. We do need a bigger ladle. This is gonna take forever. 
Okay, all of that stuff made for, this is exactly, these jars are exactly 16 ounces whenever you fill them to the top. So we've got four 16 ounce juices. Um, I think that once we get like a method down, it's not gonna be that bad, you know? Yeah. But we still have our other juice to make, which has pineapple and beets in it, but we're gonna do that That's tomorrow. everything. Yeah, it is. So it's Tuesday morning and last night we actually we wandered over to North Austin and went to this place called Painting with a Twist and if you guys have never been to a place like that basically it's like a painting lesson that you go with a group of friends and it was at 7 so it was 7 to 9 it was 18 and up so it wasn't it, it was kind of a difficult painting to be honest but you can bring drinks like beer or you can bring <laughs> like a lot of people will bring like wine and, and cheese and stuff and they'll sneaks. um yeah sneak sneaks sneaks sneak. you don't have to sneak them in <laughs> these are snacks you don't have to sneak yes yeah but it was fun like uh just go and you just judge each other you know mm -hmm. real real big judge fest yeah so yeah i mean it's actually everyone's real supportive like oh i like your rocks or i like your waterfall or mm -hmm. That's not a waterfall. <laughs> like, <laughs> you know, really were supportive you? stuff like that. Yeah. So, it, it was a lot of fun. Um, and the instructor is understanding. Yes. <laughs> At least one of them. But so they they walk you through the painting, like from the blank canvas. They tell you which paint to use, and they do it with you. But they also have finished product there. So. You guys make sure to stay tuned to the end because we're gonna have y'all vote on the best ones. Um, and we actually had a disqualification. Robbie was disqualified because at the very end he had some help with his. So there's gonna be three paintings that we, we want you guys to choose which one you like the best. Because um, we have a contest and whoever wins gets bragging rights. So yeah. we're gonna get into the painting part. Hope you guys enjoy it and we'll see y'all at the end. It's too dark. You're not, you're not talking about me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we find our spot. Are we Robert? Yep. We're right right the first one here. We're, yes. we're literally right up front. You guys can move next to us if you want to. Oh, I see my apron. Go drink the whatever okay. water. No. Boy toy. <laughs> That's not gonna be that bad. Oh shoot. What do you mean it's not gonna be that bad? Where can I put myself in there? <laughs> <laughs> I wanna do that one. You wanna do that one? Oh that one's beautiful. So, we have a challenge going on right now between Blair and myself. I guess everybody. We could do it against everybody. Oh, do y'all want the internet to vote on who has the best painting after we're done? Sure. We should do that. Yeah. Whoever has the best one is going to go into the RV. The other one well, is going to go. Of every... Not of everybody. And then, uh, why are you so close? <laughs> we're not submission. Yeah. I'm going cross eyed. We have a couple paintings in the RV uh, that aren't ours, so we're hopefully going to get one of ours in this time. And there's limited space, so we can't both go in there, especially with the same painting. We can't. <laughs> just, <laughs> yeah, just the Batman one, yeah. And then this. Alright, calm down. <laughs> yeah. Breaking the internet. 
job. Uh, so, worker art number one. <laughs> I think that one's unfinished. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Quote rule is don't suffer in silence. Uh, if you're painting along and you look really happy, but maybe halfway through this, you decide to paint a taco, like in your forest or something. I'm gonna let you do that. That's totally fine. Do whatever you want. Oh, okay, I think it's, I think it's yeah. She's like, stop. I don't contaminate the whole thing. So white on both sides. Side of the Dark Eight. colors. Yeah, mine's definitely this is a lighter. nice golden hue. Yeah, mine's lighter. Yours is dark. I like your dark. I like dark. Thanks. Switch. Switch me. No, mine's better. Oh. <laughs> this is the base. We're still, we're still just starting. You ready to reveal? Mine. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Man. Not terrible. That'll look nice in the RV. Did all that painting make you hungry? Yes. Obviously, I just need a little bit of Taco Bell. Take the edge off of all just my anger. Just a little bit. <laughs> Not that I lost. Where's this little checkout line? Thing? Right. Thank you. Have fun out there. Yeah, hold that, that for me. So she was awkward. She didn't say anything. She did. She smiled. Oh, did she? Yeah. Sir, Me? why are you in my life? <laughs> that could be our new thing is just saying it to random people and then seeing how they respond. <laughs> and then drive away quickly. <laughs> Have fun with it. Have fun with it, Mike. So yeah, that was the uh, the painting. Yeah, take a look at all three of them. Three, right? We're doing just the three? Yeah. No yeah. no Robbie in this one? No. Yeah. He had help. Right. He was disqualified. Yeah, and I definitely did not have help. So, uh... I'll have them numbered on the screen for you guys, so you can just put one, two, or three in the comments. Um, it doesn't really matter whose is whose. We're just gonna vote on whose is the best. So, <laughs> so it doesn't matter whose is whose. <laughs> they might not know which one is mine. Um, but yeah, one, two, or three in the comments, and then we will let you guys know in Thursday's video who won and who won bragging rights. And then Matt and I, I think we're gonna do like a little Instagram vote, like a poll, and see whose wins on there and whose ever wins on Instagram actually gets hung in the trailer and the other one gets burned. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> we'll figure out um, what to do with it, yeah. But yeah, that's gonna be it for today's video. Hopefully y'all enjoyed it, a little bit of everything. The weather is finally clearing up, which is really, really nice. So hopefully it'll dry up um, because we've been kind of stuck in the mud for two weeks now, which is not always fun. But yeah, anyway, take over. All right, have fun out there, guys. <laughs> oh, that's it? Yeah, that's it. Okay, bye, guys. What are all these things? So we have carrots. Fish. Wait. No. Fruit. Cool. Yep. 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 Yeah. Yep. So hopefully we start making uh, good money off this. Not really. Wait, what? <laughs> In an idea, like, oh, no, I don't know what I'm doing. Does it even go here? It didn't come with it? Whoa, calm down. No, seriously. I want this space to work better. And look, you left the paper towel right in front of the camera. Hey guys, so... <laughs> what? I'm making it quieter. <laughs> no. Alright guys. <laughs> Alright guys. So, I don't have, know how to transition <laughs> from... What do I say? Yeah. The, the... <laughs> oh, that's my only contribution to this whole video. Yeah. <laughs> no, for a second. Three million and so uh yeah just take a look you know whoever has the best abstract rocks maybe i don't know will you stop what <laughs> okay so okay hope you guys okay well okay bye yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> okay, rainy day later. fun video <laughs>